All right, Sex Gaming XX are here, and today I'm gonna be um, showing you guys, or just telling you guys a couple um tips or a couple ways to rank up faster in Call of Duty Advanced Warfare. There are a lot of people who are ranking up faster than me, but if you guys are slow, are really being slow on ranking up, you guys are just like not having any prestige yet. I'm on um, prestige too, but yeah, there are some people who are loving up faster than me but that's maybe because of different playtime or maybe just different skill but anyway um first first tip you can use is if you go to your armory um you can actually sell the uh your armor and stuff so the way you sell it has to be either green so enlisted blue or the like a brownish type, it's just like a ready, redder, more a readier type than uh, this, and you can sell them all for different uh, amounts of XP. So this is just 500, and then the blue would be um, a thousand, and then the brownish would be 2,000. I'm pretty sure I've sold all my green and like brown colors because I usually sell the stuff that I don't really care about. So like there was a pants I didn't really like, or it was like it was like a hat I didn't really like. So I sold some of that stuff, and I just got a lot of XP from it. If you save up your stuff, I got over 200,000 XP just from selling stuff that I didn't like. So, this is mainly the stuff that I wanted to keep or the stuff that I couldn't sell. But, you so, yeah. Okay, so another thing you can do is you can also complete these um attachments. Like, let's say I go for 20 kills. If you complete that, you get a certain amount of XP in the game. Have you ever had those games where you finish it and you only get like 7,000 XP, but in the game you actually had like 5,000 XP? That's because you didn't really complete anything. But then there'll also be another game where you get like 100,000 XP, and that'll be put. And that'll be because you complete anything. Like you can complete one of these, or you can complete a camo. These do give you some amount of XP, but most of them don't give you that money. But if you, if you go for one of the, some of the camos, like. You unlock these camos, I'm pretty sure gold gives you a good amount. But you can just unlock these camos and you can get a good amount of XP. And it just goes a lot better for ranking up a lot faster. So you can get up in those higher procedures more quickly. And yeah, on to the next tip. Okay, guys, so now for some actual in game tips. If you guys didn't know this, Hardpoint is the best game mode for um, ranking up and getting that high XP in the game. So, yeah, anyway, if you guys are actually playing in the hard point, what you're, gonna, you're not going to want to um, just stand there and like sit in one spot, as a lot of people do. If you ever run into a hard point and you'll just see someone like sitting in spot, and you'll just see them sitting right there. This guy right here, actually, yeah, he did not do a very good job at that because he sat in the corner. You're going to want to be moving around a lot, checking all the exits, all the entrances. As you can see right there, I picked up quite a few kills, and I got my UAV. And that UAV is going to be, uh, it's going to get me quite a bit of points. It can, it can get you up to 150 points at some points, depending on how many kills your teammates decide to get. Right here, my team has decided to get a lot, so I get a lot more XP from that. You can also get a lot of other um, score streaks, obviously. But yeah, when you you want to be running around a lot, checking all the entrances, exits, you don't want to you don't want to sit in. My team actually did do a not a very good job of that because right there, as you can see, he kind of let down. They're kind of all sitting there, and they're standing still. Right there. He, I got killed because I wasn't watching, I wasn't looking behind me, I wasn't watching my exit. So it was an easy kill. It's easy to come in and just pick him up. So, anyway, yeah, that's pretty much it for this one. Okay, guys, so now for the last tip. You're going to want to be using good attachments on your weapons and a good, good score streaks. Now, since I'm a low level because I just prestiged, I like to use the... UAV, Missile Strike, and Warbird. Usually, I change the Warbird to either the Paladin or the Bombing Run, but since I haven't unlocked either of those, I don't have that. What I really would not suggest using at all is the Goliath. It is not very good. It doesn't have a lot of health. The accuracy on it is pr is not very good. 
So my personal favorites are the UAV missile strike and the bombing run. So if you want to be getting a lot, if you want to be getting a more XP, um, what I use on the on the UAV usually is only extra points because um it gets you at least five more points and that can be racking up a lot of points. If you have your friends in with you, you guys are playing the objective, you get your UAV, you put it in, you can get up to 100, 250 XP at times, you can be getting a lot of XP, Just and you're not even getting kills for it. You can be getting a lot of XP for that UAV attachment. Truly, I don't usually have attachments on any of their score streaks, but if I was going to pick for a missile strike, I would use the cluster missile or the hellfire missile. So those two are my personal favorites. And my, if I am gonna use something, I just suggest keeping it normal though. But I am gonna put the cluster missile on. And for I don't usually I don't put anything on the bombing run or the paladin or warbird if I am using it. But yeah, guys, the UAV and the missile strike it can be getting you some extra XP in that game. Also for attachments, I'm not saying. This is the best class. I'm just saying this is what I use and it works pretty well. If you want to try it out, see if it works. I seem to like this a lot. So, my uh, personal favorite er, for the the BAL 27 or BAL 27, I use the stock quick draw grip and um, or is it the foregrip? That's what I use for the BAL 27. And if I am going to use the AK 12, I use quick draw grip, stock, and then the auto focus sight, because just because I enjoy it. So the stock is 20 hit fire kills, so that's just pretty much 20 kills when you're not aiming in, so just like, I'm pretty much a no scope, just not with a sniper, just with whatever gun you're using, that's a hit fire kill. And then you guys should know what headshot is, you kill a person with the head, and then the foregrip is just get 10 kills while aiming down the sight, no, I just need one more for that. I haven't really been getting too much done for this. I have the AK-12. So, yeah, guys, this has been a couple tips to help you rank up um, faster. If uh, this did help, please leave it. Take a second to leave a like below. Uh, subscribe. Tell tell anyone your what you like to use on your class or anything I missed. Hope you guys enjoy. Hope you guys get ranking up a lot faster. I will see you guys later. Bye, guys. Mm -hmm.